In the back of my mind, probably like in the back of yours, it's like, we've been there. We've orbited the moon. We've seen these things before. So what is Artemis II going to bring that is new to this? And just based on our geometry as we fly around the moon, they, our science team put up a picture on a giant projector, and it was the far side of the moon that has been seen by human eyes. And there is a very likely chance that we will see 60% of the far side that has never been seen by human eyes. I'm going to add just one more thing. Like Reed, I was skeptical at first as well. I saw the excitement that they had with respect to if like the human eye is just like Christine was saying, it is a magical instrument. Our brain can pick out subtle differences and they've identified these areas that they're training us on that they want to them, they look different than most of the moon, but these areas also look the same. And they're wondering if the human eye will be able to pick up something that shows that this is different from that different. And that could actually point us to now we want to go get more data there. This is where we want to send a rover next because that we might see a subtle hue or a subtle glint 